SHOT SHOW 2016 at the SOG booth, here with Chris, how are you? Hey, pretty good, how are you doing? Really good, thanks for having me back. Thanks for coming by. Right on, we got some multi-tools to talk about. Yeah, this is the year of the multi-tool for us, so I'm going to dive right in real quick. So, first one here, we introduced this last year, so it's probably familiar to most everybody. Yeah. This is the switch plier, I just yeah. want to bring it up, it's a really badass tool. Switch plier, because you push the button, works just like a switch blade, pliers pop out of there. Got nice spring loaded pliers on there. Push the button, fold it back in. Nice, got a little pocket clip on there for everyday carry. Super cool. So, again, this is a switch plier. We introduced that last year, but just want to bring it up and talk about it again. Sure. So, uh, going off of this one, we decided to make another tool, pocketable carry. And with this, what we did is we distilled it down to the to items you need most often. So, you have a nice pair of pliers in there, a wire cutter. You also have an assisted opening knife blade right here. So, it pops oh, right open. Nice. It's a little liner lock, you press the liner, you can close the blade. The other thing right here, you've got a bit holder right here. So this holds a Phillips hand straight blade quarter or hex drive bit. But the way that works is here on the end of the pliers, there's a little magnet in there that holds the tool in there. And use that as your driver. No way. So it's all your torques going this way and you're what? pushing this way. Versus having some arm out and trying to twist it all weird. <laughs> all just right there. Oh my gosh, that's so, so that's, cool. That's a really cool feature. So I mean, this tool has pliers, wire cutter, knife, Phillips and straight blade screwdrivers. So this is more of a bit storage spot. It's bit storage only. Okay, you wouldn't recommend... The, no, okay, not, it's not the, built it'll, it'll spin in there so you won't really be able to get torque. Gotcha. And then the last feature that's a very necessary feature at the end of the day, you've got this little cam right here, you can pop that down, you've got a bottle opener on there. Ah. <laughs> you can't end the day without a bottle opener. <laughs> Amen, right on. So this is brand new to be out, first part of March. Retail of $64. Pretty cool. Pretty so, cool. What's this one called? The Reactor. Sorry about that. No, you're good. The Reactor. Yep. And so, pocket size. Oh, that's a, that's a nice lightweight, too. Yeah. Good clip on it. Oh, my gosh. Really good size for EDC. Good yeah, lightweight. Perfect. I mean, that's, you know, mm -hmm. we just sell it down. What are people using all the time? You're using your pliers, your knife. Yep. Straight blades, Phillips screwdriver on there. Yep. I'm down with that. Well done. And then this retracts or folds yeah, back folds in just back like in. that. Yep. Oh, cool. I like it. Well done. What so, else? Is there one last thing real quick on that? Oh, sure. Safety switch right there. Slide that forward. Blade doesn't open oh, up. Oh, cool. So slide this little red switch. Slide it back. Yep. Oh, did I do it? Did I oh, no. That's right. There you go. Cool. Nice to have that on a spring assist. Yep. Cool. So that was the reactor. Excellent. Next one here is the power play. And it's available two ways. Either with this hard molded sheath or a soft-sided nylon sheath. The soft-sided nylon sheath comes with a hex bit kit. The hard molded sheath is just a hard molded friction fit sheath, which I'll demonstrate here. It's got a, those, one of those rubber, sort of stretchy grommet things to hold a tool in, but you don't need it because it's a friction fit. So it just slides right in. So if you're in and out of the tool, you're using it a lot, you slide it right in and out, keep it on your belt. You don't have to worry about opening the flap or anything like that. Very cool. Um, so pull the tool out itself. It's a nice traditional multi-tool. Has our gear patented compound leverage here that just like the reactor has as well. Okay. Has a does a generates twice the uh, gripping and leverage force of a conventional plier bit setup. Sure. Um, has outboard opening tools. So you have a knife blade that's accessible from the outside of the tool without having to open the pliers. And on the same side you have a bottle opener, can opener, screwdriver, and a fully serrated blade. Nice. So I'll close that. And then if I open it up on the inside of this handle, we have a file and a saw and a couple other components. I think the awl and a straight blade screwdriver are in there. So those all stay there. And it's got a nice smooth feel for the hand. It's got some ruler marks on there as well. Can I try it? Yep. Thank you. Yeah, it's a good size. Feels good in hand, nice and rounded. Could see using that for a good little while. Yeah. Very and, cool. And just like the reactor, we implemented our bit driver right here. So you can kind of see the magnets right there. Uh -huh. And you know, the bit stays in there, it's not going to fall out. And then it just kind of presses. Yeah, it's just, our, there. Yeah, it's just it's held in place. It. Yep. Oh man, that's so cool. That's such a great idea. Yeah, we're pretty psyched about it. So these, uh, with this is the power play. And with the molded sheath here, it's 79 and with the nylon sheath with bit kit, it's 89 So $10 more, you get a carrier, carry the, the tool and the bit kit all in one set. Nice. So cool. Yeah. There's some great multi-tool offerings from SOG this year. 
Very excited about that. I'm really into this guy right here. This guy, yeah, the yeah, reactor. The reactor. That's going to be our fun one this year. That is super cool. You're going to sell a ton of those. I hope so. I'm positive. I mean, the switch buyer is super awesome too. Yep. But I love this just for function and minimal, minimalistic. Yeah. I love it. Right on, Chris. Thank All you right. so much for Thanks. that little multi-tool walkthrough. We're at the SOG booth at SHOT Show 2016.